Hello, my name is Chris and I'm a U-Haul hitch professional. Installing a hitch on your Honda HRV can lead to some amazing adventures, such as biking, camping, or road trips to your favorite destination. You can even tow a U-Haul trailer just about anywhere in North America. Now, let's take a look at this install. You will need the following tools or supplies to complete this installation. We're going to begin this installation by removing five fasteners from our lower fascia. Three of them are going to be trim retainer clips. There are two here. As well, there's one hidden in the bumper. And then we have two Phillips head screws hidden one here and one on the other side we're going to remove. For your second screw behind the tailpipe, we found it convenient to add an extension. Use the Phillips head bit to release one screw on the driver's side and one screw on the passenger side. You can now gently pull and release this section of fascia. You can use a flathead screwdriver to reach in between the tab on the silver fascia and the black plastic holding it down. Pry the silver fascia piece down gently and you will be able to pull it away from the vehicle. We can now remove factory hardware from the bumper beam. There will be two hex head screws on either side of the vehicle. Use a 12 millimeter socket to remove them. We are now ready to raise the hitch into place. I will be using this U-Haul exclusive hitch jack. If you do not have one, it may be helpful to get a second set of hands to hold the hitch up while we insert the hardware. You can now install your new M8 hex head bolt. Place on a conical tooth washer with the teeth facing the hitch plate. Always install hardware hand tight till all hardware is in the vehicle before tightening and torquing. Now line up the center mounting location to the vehicle's tow loop. You can now use your half inch carriage bolt to pass through the center mounting location. Put on the carriage plate and then the half inch flange nut. We can now tighten and then torque our hardware. Let's begin first with our M8 bolts using a 13 millimeter socket and perhaps an extension to clear the fascia. You can now torque your half inch bolt using a three quarter inch socket. We're now ready to trim our bumper fascia to return it to the vehicle. We have lined it up on the vehicle so we can make marks with a marking device to show the two and one quarter inch section we need to mark off. After marking off where the receiver will go, we have lined out a two inch by two and one quarter inch section using masking tape as a straight edge. Now use your cutting tool of choice to cut this out. You can use a metal file to straighten your edges and clean up any frayed plastic. Push the frayed plastic in, don't pull out. You can now return the fascia to the vehicle. Start at one edge, push the fascia in. You may have to reach up in with your opposing hand to provide the leverage to clip the clips in. Due to the hitch being in the way, my arms don't fit. I'm going to reach in over the hitch with the tool to try to provide some leverage to push this back in. Once you have your leverage tool in place, give it a good tap and you should feel it click into place. Now return all the previously removed fasteners. For your hidden center bumper clip, we're not gonna be able to show you because the hitch is in the way. Remember it's right up in here. We have to reach in the fascia and do this completely by feel. Now that our hitch is installed, we've pulled the vehicle onto level ground to show you some important measurements. This is a inch and a quarter receiver. From the pinhole to the end of the bumper is a three inches. From the ground to the top of the receiver is 13 inches. These measurements will help you determine the necessary length rise or drop of your hitch accessories like a ball mount, bike rack, ski carrier, or cargo carrier. If you have any questions about the products seen in this video, or if you'd like to schedule an installation with your local U-Haul hitch professional, 
please visit us online at uhaulhitches.com. You can also download the U-Haul app using the link in the description for even more ways to manage your hitch and towing needs.